Hey yo, what's up, what's up, what's up? This is Games for Days, and today we are looking at the top 5 skins in the Fortnite Battle Royale from the Battle Pass. This consists of skins from Season 1 to Season 7, and there are some rules before we begin. There are no Tier 1 skins or Tier 100 skins eligible to be on this list. These are rated on customizability to be mixed into a combo, just the skins and not the sets. Also, the look of them doing different emotes throughout the game is a factor. All the skins are listed in the description, not in order, of course. That's to keep to the mystery. If you want to know which one is number one or number five, you're going to have to watch the whole video. Another factor is their OG rating. I've researched when the skins have come out and done some quick math to figure out their OG rating. This holds less power than the aesthetic points, but still plays a role. Another rule. Scroll down just a little bit and you'll see a big red button. I strongly urge you not to click that button or my entire channel will blow up. The only way to counter this is by clicking the bell that pops up after. That'll stop the countdown. Also go down to the description and my Instagram along with Natalie's is there, go check that out. Along with the gang's channels, go check those out. But please make sure I always have more subscribers than Bla Brad Blitzkid. And in order to do that you have to share this video. So anyone you know that likes Fortnite skins, go ahead and share them this video link. Now let's get started with our list. Coming in on our list in 5th place, we have the Dusk skin. This was a skin you could get in the Season 6 Battle Pass at Tier 71, and her dark features made it to where she could be very useful at night, but much less useful during the day, because people could see her from a distance. Aesthetically, in my opinion, she's a 6 out of 10 because of the claws and the purple accents throughout the skin. I'm a fan of purple, and I'm a real big fan of claws, but compared to the other skins on the list, she's not that high up. Her OG rating was a 2 out of 10 because she is a recent skin compared to the others on this list, and her customizability was at a 6 out of 10 because there isn't wiggle room for colors. It's either black or nothing. Next on our list at 4th place we have the Dark Voyager. This was a skin you could earn at Season 3 at Tier 70. His LEDs made it to where you could be spotted during the night time, but this was before the customizability of a skin so they're set as orange. Aesthetically, he gets a 4 out of 10 because of this LED problem. His OG rating is a 7 out of 10 because he is one of the oldest skins on this list, and his customizability is at a 5 out of 10 because, again, it's black or nothing. His overall score was a 16 out of 30. At third place, we have the Rust Lord skin, and this was a skin in Season 3 at Tier 23, making him the oldest on this list. Aesthetically, he gets a 6 out of 10 because he looks decent, and I love the helmet he wears with all his spikes. His OG rating is a 9 out of 10 because he is the oldest one on this list, and his customizability is at a 2 out of 10 because no combo looks good unless it's his or maybe the Ruckus skin combo. His overall score is a 17 out of 30. In second place, we have the Valor skin. This skin comes from the old, so old Season 4 at Tier 71. I love the look of this skin because it's very Wonder Woman style, and because of that, it gets a 7 out of 10 aesthetically. Her OG rating is a 10 out of 4 because she is one of the newer skins compared to some on this list, and her customizability is a 7 out of 10 because she looks good with many sets on. Her overall score is an 18 out of 30. And finally, in first place, is my favorite skin from any Battle Pass ever, the Technique skin. This skin is, was from Season 4 and could be gotten at Tier 23. She looks good in any combo because of the color mix-ups in her skin, and she is an oldie, and you know what they say, old is gold. Her aesthetic rating is a 9 out of 10, her OG rating is a 5 out of 10, and her customizability was an 8 out of 10, giving her the highest score on this list of a 23 out of 30. That's been the video. I know it probably wasn't as long as some of you would like, but tell me if you'd like to see a part two down in the comments. Tell me what you thought about this video and what I could do better, and be sure to smash a like. It's always appreciated. Go share this video around with your friends, especially if they like Fortnite skins and the oldest Battle Pass ever, Battle Pass from Season Negative 3. Go check out the gang's channels in the description and subscribe to me if you're new because I need subscribers to feed my Magic Dragon Pete so he can 
poop out a giveaway at 500 that is going to come so be sure to stick around and be active on all of my videos go check out natalie's instagram in the description along with mine and i do hope to see you in the next one peace